Welcome ladies and gentlemen to a very magical people playground video. Today we are checking out the mod Fish Black Magic by neither fish nor cat. This is the fish black magic. Soon the cat black magic will arrive and then we will have the fish cat magic. I, I don't know. <laughs> I think this is supposed to be a play on words for his name, but I'm not sure. So we're going to skip over it and pretend like I never saw it. This is actually cool. They have a way, a set of steps you must follow to learn a magic power. This is like uh, you got to go in the bathroom, shut off the lights, say Bloody Mary three times and spin around and then you'll get possessed. It's just like that, except it's cooler and it's uh, not fake. Oh my God, the bandy mod updated, guys. Not this one. This one. You guys remember this one? Oh, wait, why do I look so dirty? <laughs> I look like I fell into a mud puddle. They updated, look, they added bandy gun. This has nothing to do with the video. <laughs> Step one, place an altar and then place six candles on the altar. All right, where is the altar? Dang, that's that's creepy. This, this is the altar? That's a lot bigger than I thought. Okay, you stand in there. We're gonna place the candles. Candles, one. Two, three, four, five, six. There we go. We got to light them. Light all the candles. Boom. We're basically performing magic at this moment in time. Oh my God. This is what I was meant to do. I don't want to be a YouTuber. I want to be a wizard. Okay, we have our candles on the altar. We need an object. Uh, it says, I don't know what that actually means. Uh, what is an altar object? What does that even mean? Large mirror? Activate? Act- Whoa! What happened? What happened? What happened? Where did I go? You go in there, figure out what happened to him. I mean me. Is my life force trapped in this mirror now? You're just gonna walk away. All right, fine. I'll figure it out myself. What happens if I tip it over? Will, will I uh, lose my soul forever if this mirror breaks? Very strong mirror made of titanium, made of diamonds from Minecraft, I, I presume. It got really foggy in here for some reason when I lit those candles. There better not be any jump scare coming out of this fog right now. We're spawning the altar. The altar can crush me. Okay, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna place me on the altar. We are going to place the six candles required. We are going to light them. Let the ceremony commence. The crown. We summon the crown of the beast. Summon him. Give him the power of God. I think I'm powerful now. I'm not really sure. I have some sparkles coming out of me. Put this crown on. You are the king now. Me. <laughs> I deserve this. I've worked very hard. Okay, that's a really heavy crown. What the heck? Falls right off every time. Okay. What can I do with my newfound magical abilities? Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Oh, it's glowing. Is that my only ability? Really? Are you kidding me? I can, I can turn a light on and off. That is my one ability. Wait, what? I can transform into animals? Select an animal to transform into. Snail, snake, spider, frog, or cockroach. Why are they all so small? All right, we're going to snake mode. Activate. How do I actually transform though? I don't get it. I, I did all the black magic. I, I did everything. I followed the five step program and I'm still not a rich wizard yet. Are you kidding? Ah, uh, we have some information about the transformation magic here. Transform any human into animals. Only death or a kiss can break the curse. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, I understand why I can turn into a frog now. This makes a lot more sense. Activate their hand and touch another to transform them. Here we go. Here we go. Snake time. <coughs> Oh my god, it worked. Do I really gotta kiss a snake? No way. I ain't kissing a snake. Can I turn an android into a snake? Yes, I can. Here he is. I'm- It looks like there's even more particle effects around me. Oh my god. I'm just leaking energy magic. So incredible. Okay, okay, wait. Stand up. I know you broke your, your leg or something. What's wrong with you? How do I bring him back? He's stiff as a board. You told me this was gonna turn into a snake. This is cardboard. Kiss. Oh, it worked! From an android to a snake, back to an android. I'm gonna turn this guy into a spider. Thank you for your service or whatever. Quickly, before I die, before the magic is gone, I'm bleeding out. <sighs> okay, you're a spider now. <laughs> yeah, good luck for someone trying to kiss you, dude. No one's kissing that. No one's gonna kiss a spider. You did this to yourself, basically. Okay, I'm dead. I don't believe there I can turn him back, but well, let's give it a shot. Oh, it worked. <laughs> wait, oh wait, no, no. 
Oh, oh wait, I was dead, so he died? I'm glad that the developer thought of that. What if you get kissed by a dead person? Then you get transformed back, but you die. This is why it's black magic, you can't trust it. Wait, robot! Why did that robot die? Oh, he was linked spiritually with that guy, which was linked spiritually with the other guy, which is now dead. I didn't know it kept track of this. That's so much forethought. I'm impressed, you know what? Consider me impressed. That is the mark of someone who really cares about this mod. I'm having an amazing time at this moment. All right, get out of here. We gotta set the table up. Light the candles, throw them on there. Bandy wizard, we need you now more than ever. I don't remember what I used to give myself that ability. I, oh wait, it was the crown, wasn't it? It was the crown. Enchant me. All right, we turn everybody into a frog. Let's go, people. One at a time, I'm going to turn each and every one of you into a frog. You're a frog. Hold on a second. Hold on now. I gotta kiss this frog real quick. Oh god, no! They're spawning inside of each other! Get out! Okay, everyone, it looks like everyone, everyone's connected to this guy. This guy kissed a lot of people. <laughs> this is so funny. Alright. We just gotta... Hopefully these guys die. Oh, it worked! It literally worked! We got two guys left standing. I really don't know who, who's connected to who anymore, really. We will start our next seance. Start the candles. Bring us our victim. We spawn a human on the altar and activate the altar. Ah, yes. Now he is turning green. So now, once we have taken our altar item, we hold out the magic user's hand and he binds himself to the doll. Oh, I got it to work. Okay, you activate his arm, I think, and then you touch him with it. I don't know. You need the green light to be coming out of the guy's arm and then touch the voodoo doll to him, and then it works. Accept this voodoo doll into your heart. Whoa, okay, it worked. Okay, I actually think it worked. You hit F over it, and then do damage to this guy. I don't know what this is supposed to do. He's linked. Oh, he's he's literally linked with this guy somehow. But I killed him. It's not doing any damage. Hold on, what if I do this? What if I do this? Oh, it worked! Oh, it's actually working. That's crazy. That was really complicated to set up, but uh that's cool. I like that. I'm gonna I'm gonna give that an approve. Necromancy is even a subject of this mod. We grab a skull, place it on the altar. Give this man the ability to resurrect the dead, considering we have a dead bandy right over there sitting on his voodoo doll. We take the character with the magical ability. Take out his hand. Summon a ghost. Okay, ghost, resurrect this guy now. You're gonna resurrect me. Oh my god, it worked! It worked! I'm alive! Does the voodoo doll still work, though? Oh yeah. Wait, why is he so strong now? The necromancy made him ten times stronger. Oh, I just killed a wizard. I collided through his head and shot the wizard. Wait, what happens if we kill the original guy? The voodoo doll is, is, is over, okay? The voodoo doll was removed. They turned back into dolls. That's so cool. I love the idea of consistency in this mod. It's actually really great. I didn't cover absolutely everything that this had to offer because it feels like there's a lot of detail in here. I did cover most of it. If you guys wanna go figure out the rest, I will link it in the description and go support the creator. Neither fish nor cat, very well done. Thank you for always making some really awesome mods. Huge shout out to him. I will see you all in the next video. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. I will be here um, dancing for eternity.